do what we've done, what, five times already before and pull this motor. Watch it, like it, it's good stuff. That is some high quality H2O. Good morning, folks. Welcome back to the Toy Box Garage. This morning, we're not gonna talk a whole lot because we got a lot to do. It's gonna be a really, really busy day. We gotta work fast and get this done as quick as possible because I got so much to do. But let me introduce you to somebody familiar, somebody we've had in the Toy Box Garage before. Again, we have a lot of return business in here, but look at this. Oh, <laughs> what you know about that? If you remember this car, she was beat down the last time you saw her. She is in much better shape these days. Yeah. That is some high quality H2O. So, just a little background. We've lost compression. She doesn't have compression. So, we've, we've got valves that are thrown. So, I rebuilt some heads. We're gonna slap the heads in here. Call it a day. But I gotta reposition it. So, let's start doing that. Let's get this build underway. Here we go. Alright, there she is. She's in the garage, ready to have the engine pulled. Well, there she is. This engine is rebuilt, has new timing, but has bent valves, I'm pretty sure. So, we're gonna do what we've done, what, five times already before and pull this motor. Start getting the intake off, pull intake all the way up to the, the head there. Then we will get these frontal components off. Obviously, we're gonna set the AC to the side over here, get the battery out. Set the AC where the battery is. We'll take off the power steering, set it where the intake is, take the alternator out. Then we will put our chain on it, disconnect it from the tranny back there, and pull her out. And then we'll rip those heads off. I've got two new heads in the bags right over there. See those two? They're machined, cleaned, resurfaced, and ready to go on. Let's take a look at the... Actually, I'm gonna need this because I'm gonna have to drain everything out of the engine. But let's take a look here. Oh, those valve covers are pretty dirty, but actually I can use the valve covers that are on the car. They're the exact same, so they're probably in better shape. Isn't they're kind of grungy. But yeah, look at these beautiful things. Nice and cleaned, nice and resurfaced. Good stuff. So yeah, we'll get those slapped in and we'll put the motor back in and hopefully, hopefully, and no, I'm absolutely not making any promises, but my goal, my hope is that I can get it done in one day. Get it done by tonight so you can come pick it up tomorrow. Let's see if we can do this. Oh, I need to show you real quick. Excuse the mess. It's the messy garage as always because I don't have time to clean it because I'm working on stuff. We've got our evergreen gasket set. So we're gonna use this, put new gaskets on the heads and slap her back together. So I'm gonna gather up some tools. I'm gonna get my cherry picker, my engine hoist if you will, together. Bring it over here and start disassembling this. And I'm gonna put you on a time lapse so you can watch the time lapse as you've done a million times before. Watch it, like it, it's good stuff. Here we go. 